Now, the breach of the key dam in Ukraine has triggered a deadly chain reaction. The Dnipro River water has now inundated 600 square kilometers of land, triggering a humanitarian and ecological catastrophe. But most concerning of all is the threat of a nuclear disaster. The Novokokovka dam, used to supply cooling water to Europe's largest nuclear power plant, but the operators of the Zaporizhia plant say that the reservoir can no longer meet the plant's needs. Since the dam is now breached, the water from the reservoir is getting continuously discharged downstream. Zaporizhia nuclear power plant's chief operator says the water level at the reservoir has already gone below the critical point of 12.7 meters in the ponds at the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant station to cool the plant. However, according to the Zaporizhia regional governor, the plant is for now in a stable situation and the radiation levels in and around the plant are within the normal range. Furthermore, according to Russia's uh, Rosatom State Corporation, both technical and stewardship staff are fully prepared for emergency rescue repairs. The International Atomic Energy Agency has also said in a statement that uh, Ukraine's Zaporizhia nuclear power plant is continuing to pump cooling water from the Kakovka Reservoir. The UN nuclear watchdog chief, Rafael Grossi, is due to visit the plant next week. To everyone's relief, a large cooling pond next to the site is still intact. It has enough in storage to supply the plant for several months. The plant staff have already implemented measures to limit the consumption of water.